Friends, I'm Robin Black, KSW analyst. It is my privilege to analyze these brilliant fighters, these elegant martial artists in this incredible, incredible fight show out of Poland. I want to tell you right now about KSW 42. March 3rd, you're going to get it, kswtv.com. Brilliant fights from top to bottom, but it is this main event that everybody is talking about. Mamed Khalidov, one of the great fighters on planet Earth, the best middleweight in the world in this analyst's opinion. KSW middleweight champion, hasn't lost in eight years, undefeated in 20 fights in KSW. Smooth yet violently explosive. This man, Khalidov, when he fights, you have to watch. And it is a champion versus champion matchup as he faces KSW light heavyweight champion, Thomas Narkoon. They're meeting at a catch weight. It's not about a belt. We've been saying this all week long. History, legacy, immortality. This fight will be brilliant and I can't wait. You must, you must, you must watch this fight. Narkoon has finished 14 fights. All of the fights he has won are all by finish. 12 of them in the first round and two of them took a couple extra minutes and finished them in the second round. This is a dangerous fighter. Let's take a look at both these brilliant martial artists, starting with, let's say, Mamed Khalidov. When Khalidov fights, you must watch if you are a fan of martial arts. He'll rip out the arm here against Kendall Grove, and once he takes a piece of your body, he takes it home with him. The pressure on that leg is excruciating, and Despida has to tap here. Brutal, brutal submission artist, flowy grappler. Watch this stuff right here against James Irvin, and he will defend here, slide him into guard, and he is a master from the guard position. He'll come up, isolate, pull the head down, watch as he will isolate two arms, and this will look absolutely effortless. Under the leg, rotates behind the head, an immediate tap, hyperextends that arm, just about rips it off. And here's my favorite against Rodney Wallace. Jab, jab, right hand, and he'll put him away. Pump, pump, bam! Drops him. Beautiful. Unbelievable. Incredible, right? Special. A very, very special martial artist. If you're a KSW fan, you already know how special Mama it is. If you're from the rest of the world, you must see this fight. He seems unstoppable, right? Now, not when you're facing somebody bigger, stronger, the light heavyweight KSW champion, somebody who stops almost everybody. All 14 wins by finish, 12 in the first round. Last four fights, four first round finishes, three KOs, one submission. Let's take a look at the KSW light heavyweight champion, Thomas Narkoon. Thomas Narkoon, not afraid to face anyone. This young man has already fought some of the best in the world. The first thing you will notice in his grappling game is that he moves like a lightweight. For a big man, he also hits like a truck. There's the right hand, and he takes out Goran Relic, one of only two men to ever beat him, rematched him in his last four fights. He has taken out a mall in the first round. Exciting passionate fighter, the double knee right there and immediately goes to the left hand. There the wizard for control and pounds him out with the right hand. You think he's dangerous from top and on the feet. Look at him take out Sokaju right here. The big knee and then starts to unload on Sokaju. Facing the best fighters in the world, not afraid to face the great Mohamed Khalidov. This fight will be epic and look at him off his back. This is a light heavyweight. Light heavyweight champion. You don't see light heavyweights finish triangles from guard all that often, but Thomas Narkoon is a special fighter. Your main event, my friends, Thomas Narkoon versus Mohamed Khalidov at KSW 42, March 3rd. Get it now at kswtv.com. This is going to be epic. It has been my privilege to bring you KSW analysis for this brilliant card. I can't wait for it. Enjoy the hostilities, my friends.